Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So uh, before I get started on this video, I just wanna address a couple things. Um, I am filming on my camera this time around. I didn't feel like doing the big production with the lights and the, the big camera and everything. Um, if you guys follow my community tab, I did let you guys know I was not feeling well. I was actually hospitalized um, Sunday and I'm still not feeling the best. Um, but I'm definitely in a better place than what I was on Sunday. So not to go into too many details, but I basically had a cyst rupture on my ovary. And if you have ever had that happen, it is painful. It is so painful. Um, I basically, I've had three kids and I don't remember labor being that bad. <laughs> um, it was such excruciating pain that they actually scheduled morphine shots every four hours to try and keep me as comfortable as possible. Um, I hope that you guys have not experienced that, but if you have, you definitely know what I am talking about. So I'm going to keep this video kind of mellow. Um, I did receive my Ipsy and I'm, I need to, I need to pick me up and, you know, connecting with you guys and my channel is definitely what makes me happy. So, um, we're going to do this one a little bit more low key, but, uh, let's go ahead and get this started. So this is the November bag. Now, um, animal print is not really my thing. It might be yours, which is fantastic. I still think that this quality of a bag is probably one of their best bags that I have received. The quality of this is really, really nice. It's got a really nice, like, pleathery feel to it. It just feels really well made. Um, it does have, like, a little brown tassel right here. So it is cute. It's just not my style. Um, so I'll be using this as a giveaway. And... I can't wait to see what I got. Okay, big card. So for the month of November, it is Wild Side. This month, dare to step into uncharted territory, electric lipsticks, passion projects, far-flung destinations. By leaning into the unknown, you just might find the most authentic version of you. Okay, so on the inside of the card, it does give me all the info for all the products that are in my bag, so I'm not gonna open that just yet. And we're just gonna dive in. The very first product I have is from Nomad. This is their Kiss of the S Kiss of Sun bronzer and contour. That sounds really really nice. So this is the outer packaging. Very pretty. So that's a, a cute little sample size right there and they are cruelty free and vegan. So Oh, okay. This is what the bronzer looks like right here. I'm not really sure if that's gonna be too warm for me or not, so I'm not gonna swatch it just yet um, because I kinda wanna see it in sunlight versus, you know, this kind of light. And uh, if it looks too warm, then I'm gonna go ahead and put it in a giveaway. But still, it's a really nice size. And so far, I'm actually enjoying the Nomad Cosmetics brand. Going back into the bag, what is, what is this? Now this was an actually uh, a choice that I made. Now they give you a chance to choose a product for your bag and I chose this. This is the It Confidence in a Cream Transforming Moisturizer Super Cream. I've heard really, really good things about this. So I'm super, super excited to try it out. Um, it Cosmetics is actually a really nice brand. I do like their um, mascara. Uh oh, <laughs> it has one of those crazy false bottoms. But, mm. oh, that smells so good. I love that. So plenty of products inside, even with the false bottom. And of course, this is what the little thing looks like. So super, super happy with that. I mean, <laughs> why wouldn't I be? I'm the one that chose it. Anyways, uh, the next item we have is the Verso Hydration Serum never heard of it interesting package um it looks like number four on there hydrating face serum with niacinamide i don't even know what that is okay so i just opened it uh, i assumed it would have a little seal on it it did not so it's actually getting all over the place so we are just going to go ahead and it's got a 
It's got a really perfumey smell to it. Hmm. I don't know if I would want that on my face. It just has like this really perfumey uh, flower scent to it that's kind of strong. Um, but I mean, you never know. We'll see if the, the smell fades, because if the smell fades, then I can try it out. Okay, the next item we have, where oh, I feel two items left. What's this? Okay, this is the Gigi Gorgeous Touch Up Powder. Cruelty free and vegan. And I know she did a collab with Ipsy. I don't know what all the products are. Okay, so this is the packaging right here. Very plain, but I like the smooth texture to it, so it feels really nice. And it says it's a touch-up powder. This is what it looks like, so I'm guessing it's a translucent powder. Um, I'm probably going to put this in a giveaway because the only translucent powder I'm really, really enjoying right now is by Too Faced, and I have a lot of it. So I'm gonna go ahead and set that aside. I do like the packaging on here. I think it's a really nice size. So still happy with that. And the last product we have, ooh, I'm excited for this one, uh, is the Lovecraft Beauty Blush. And it's in the shade Delphine. I don't know if I said that correctly or not. Ooh, I really, really like this color. So it's like a neutral blush. And I'm really into neutral blushes right now, so this is right up my alley. It does come with a nice little mirror, super, super cute. Oh, it feels so soft. Oh, so soft. So that is the shade, and oh, that's perfect. That is a good nude blush, and oh, I'm so happy with that. <laughs> I'm so happy with that. So let's do a quick run through of everything that we had in the bag. So we got the blush, which I'm super excited for. I love the color, I love the feel of it. I'm very, very happy with the packaging and very happy with the product. Uh, we have the serum, which I was a little surprised about and not having like this, uh, the tab underneath the cap, but I mean, it is what it is. The smell seems to have subsided. So I still might be able to give this a try. So that's gonna be really interesting. Uh, we have the Confidence in a Cream, which I'm so happy for this. It smelled amazing and cannot wait to test this out. We have the Gigi Gorgeous Translucent Powder, which is a really nice size. I do enjoy the packaging of this, um, but I just have so much, so I'm gonna put this in a giveaway. And then of course we have the Nomad Bronzer, which I love the packaging of this. I love the size of it. I just wanna see uh, in the sunlight if it's gonna be too warm for me or not. Uh, so I hope that it's not and I can test this out. So I think this bag is actually a pretty decent bag. Um, I know I'm supposed to be receiving the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Um, I actually was supposed to receive that three, four days ago or something like that. Um, it's kind of interesting because the package usually goes to this one post office before it is sent to me. So once I follow tracking and I see that it has hit this post office, I'm supposed to receive it the next day. Uh, well, it has been at this post office for several days and then I noticed that it left the facility, which usually means I'm about to get my package, and it has gone to a completely different uh, USPS facility, which I, it has never done before. So I don't know what the deal with is with that. So I'll be receiving that super late. So I'm probably going to end up saving that, do a Ipsy versus Sephora play. Um, so hopefully this is just a mishap and it's not like, you know, some form of punishment for really calling Ipsy out and telling them how bad of a job they did with their newest glam bag, which by the way, I have seen reviews of this month's um, Ipsy Ultimate and I am so glad I canceled my subscription. Really glad. I am telling you guys now, don't even look into that because this is the second month and it has been a complete waste of money. Um, but I did wanna let you guys know, I signed up for BoxyCharm. I actually, I'm on the wait list for the Luxe and the Premium, but I did sign up for the uh, the original BoxyCharm. So I'm super excited. Can't wait to get uh, December's box. That's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, 
So thank you guys so much for being patient with me this week. I really, really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Um, I don't know if I will have another video this week. It might be just this one. Uh, but I know the uh, Sephora play is supposed to be here on Monday. So uh, next week's video might start on Tuesday. That way I can get that video in, the Ipsy versus Sephora play. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. I love you so much. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.